Mr. Arpan Das, hearty congratulations on securing All India Rank 3 in K2023 in Electronics Branch of Engineering. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank yeah. you very much. Right. Uh, Mr. Arpan, can you introduce yourself briefly? Yeah. So, my name is Arpan Das. Uh, I belong from Howrah, West Bengal. And I am I have done my schooling from Howrah itself. After that, I am currently pursuing my Bachelor of Technology in uh, Electronics and Communication Engineering from IIT ISM Dhanbad. And I am I currently in my final year. And yeah. No, it's a very great, uh, Mr. Arpan. Yeah. Uh, you are in, still in the final year and you got this rank of All India. Yeah. <laughs> it's a very yeah. proud moment. Mm -hmm. Very yeah. good. Uh, Mr. Arpan, you please tell us what type of coaching that you have availed from our ACE Academy. Okay, so from ACE Academy, I basically availed the mock test series of ACE Academy. And uh, that was like both the topic was tests and the full length mock test. So this is the thing that I availed from ACE Academy. Yeah. Okay. In our mock test series, there are more than 100 exams are there. Yeah. How many you have taken approximately? Approximately, uh, approximately I have taken uh, more than 80. And uh, yeah, and I also have the mock test series of Gate Academy too. And from that also like that, that around 70 to 80% mock test series I have yeah, completed. Right. Yeah. Right. Right. Mm -hmm. Good. Uh, Mr. Arpan, you please tell us how the AS Academy mock test series helped you in your uh, successful journey. Yeah. So uh, like uh, AS Academy has a very means uh, the questions quality were very good. And also after the exam, the is this means from the mock test, we could uh, get the proper analysis of my strengths and weaknesses, the areas where we should uh, miss, I can improve more. And also it would give around that uh, the rank among those, the, the my peers who are also giving the tests and it should give the overall percentage of my uh, total, like how much, how, how much I have performed till now so that was very good and the questions were quite good it was from moderate to tough also and there were very some easy questions too so i have actually uh, got a means um, got an overall idea that how gate exam actually looks like and how and i should like there is a time limit and i can complete whether i can complete all the questions in time limit so like this is the full length mock test gave me a very good idea also there is like topic wise states to the, the test so this topic was test also gave me like the strengths and weakness points of any particular subject so right. from so that orientation uh, you came to know through this gate series yes of, yeah yeah gate test series. yes good uh mr arpan in our mock test especially in the full length mock test yeah uh where you used to stand rank wise approximately uh rank wise i used to stand means my mass always used to be between 70 to 80 okay out of 100 and rank wise i usually stand on a single digit rank uh generally uh, sometimes it would cross out of 10 means out of from 1 to 10. okay and, for your mm. all in your rank of three how many marks mm. you got in the gate exam now yes uh yeah, yeah, I'm, I, yeah i got 80. 80, 80 marks, right mm. okay mr arpan mm. uh, because this our yes academy mock test series has got so many exams so hmm. how you used to take this all exams how did you uh what do you call uh, hmm. uh in what intervals you should take these exams yeah so actually there is not many my there is no any fixed schedule that i take the exams like whenever i like to give my means how much i can perform so i want to test my own knowledge so i could i uh, give those exams basically for the last two months before gate like in the december and january there was a winter vacation in our college so that was a quite free time and my syllabus was almost complete so that was the time when i took rigorously these tests and i could like in that time i only used to revise the subjects and give, give the test so at that time i could give many tests about this yeah. uh, now you are in the final year right in ias yes. dunbar yeah seriously for the gate preparation when did you start i generally i started my gate preparation like subjects i started from second year only and one more mr arpan hmm. uh, simultaneously preparing for this gate examination at the same time preparing for a university syllabus yes yes requires some sort of what you call extra effort uh, 
in yeah. coordination and also so yes. in your case how you planned uh, the git preparation simultaneously while studying the btech okay so like uh, many subjects that are in the gate examination are common with the university curriculum so actually the topics that are common i used to study from the basics only from the books i followed the standard books and i was uh, i cleared my concept very well and those things and there are also few things extra in the gate examination that is not covered in the university curriculum so from those things i took the help of youtube channel youtube uh, videos the youtube playlist and uh, from there i cleared my concept about this and then i also practice from some standard books the mcqs and the gate previous year question paper so likewise uh, i could like manage these two things yeah right see in our gate exam uh, revision is very important yes so your, sorry revision yeah. revision of the syllabus revision yes revision is very important another important is to uh, the attempt the all previous year question papers because many question because the exact question is not repeated but the concept is repeated almost every year for the last four or five years and uh, also the concept should be very much clear about the subject basics and the scoring subjects should be like it should be kept in the topmost priority like network theory control systems electromagnetic theory these are very scoring subjects and also uh, uh, i should say that in the general aptitude and mathematics should be given preferences because in most of the cases we do some silly mistakes so our rank goes down so if we can like score around full marks in this general aptitude and mathematics so that could be very much helpful okay. No, hmm. uh, say mathematics aptitude you yeah. said the uh, control system and networks networks Apart yeah from, uh, uh, can you hmm. name some more highly scoring subjects of electronics branch uh, highly scoring subjects in my opinion these are the most highly scoring subjects like the communication part is a bit uh, difficult for many of the students and uh, also i could say that in signal processing yes in the digital the signal system many questions are quite easy like this year they were quite easy and electronic device also they were like moderate and uh, digital also it is easy but for analog i could i say that is from moderate to tough because there are many questions in analog which are quite tricky to do yeah okay now what was your strategy as far as this revision is concerned how you used to carry the revision okay so i used to make actually notes for each and every subject for separate in separate notebooks and uh, i would used to like bold the points which i am like uh, i am thinking that there should be the revision should be done and after that I, i like each and every day i should like revise the notes i would like turn over the pages and look like where i am lagging in the concept and like that was only and the mock test i also gave from that i also uh, got the analysis of like in which part i am lagging in the concept or in which part i should revise more and get to the more so that is the thing okay yeah. now on the day of uh, gate examination hmm. in the 3 hours in the gate examination how yeah. what was your strategy while attempting the question uh the first strategy uh, i would say that uh, first we should uh, attempt from the general aptitude because many students do the general aptitude at the later point but the general aptitude is the easiest section of our then the most scoring section of the whole paper so that also gives the boost the confidence of a student who is appearing for the exam so that should is uh, to be done first and after that the questions should be properly done and uh, i i actually completed my whole paper like one time i completed my whole paper within just 2 hours and after that i also got the time for revision with the of around 1 hour so i got if there is some mistake also there and the questions that i was stuck uh, that questions i could solve so like that was i yeah okay so mr arpan from your yeah. successful journey yeah uh, can you please share some useful tips and suggestions for the aspirants of the gate examination in general and for mm -hmm. electronics students in particular uh in general i should say that uh, whichever subject or whichever paper you are appearing the first of thing is the concept should be clear very much and apply for uh, give so as many mock tests as possible and solve the previous year's papers very carefully so this is as general i would say suggest and for electronics students i should suggest that uh, don't ignore the tough subjects like the communications or analog systems and electromagnetic theory because uh, they are all, they are concerns a major part in the whole paper and also don't do any kind of silly mistakes in the the scoring part also so that is the thing yeah right so finally mr arpan with yeah. your uh, rank that 3 alder rank 3 mm. 
hmm. in gate exam what do you want yeah. to do are you joining uh, psu are you trying to uh, join psu otherwise mtech in iits i am trying to my dream is to do mtech from iic bangalore only uh, hmm. and i will go for that also i go for What's that and i also What specialization I will do in uh, uh, communication engineering only, oh, electronics really? and communication. Okay, right. Mm -hmm. so Because my is... plan is to do research uh, further, so I will. I, I have the plan to go foreign afterwards for PhD and all these things. Okay. Very good, uh, Mr. Arpan. Mm -hmm. so yeah. Through this video, you have shared very useful points. I think will be useful for the students as well, other aspirants of gate exam. Yes. And uh, thank you for joining. And I yeah, wish you thank you. Yeah. I wish you good luck in all your future endeavors. Yes. Thank you. Thank you, sir. God thank bless you. you. God bless you, Arpan. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Okay. Can we our wishes to your parents also? Yeah. Yeah. Sure. They should be okay. proud parents. Proud parents. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Arpan. Thank you. Yeah.